renounce your gods. Answer me. Why? Why are you doing this? Behold your so-called gods. You are demons. They burn. They are nothing. You shed tears for this creature while your heart just... Rude. Apparently I can't play Surge 2 anymore. Well, that's unfortunate. Thanks, Steam. You are mad. <laughs> Renounce your gods! Did you just murder that dude? Oh, you. Inquisitor. You gotta die. Oh. 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 You. You wear the mark of the impure pagan cult of the natives. I am Inquisitor too? Aloysius. And by authority Aloysius. of my title, I order you to explain yourself. Oh, I gotta order my the mark on my face is by no means impure. You are walking on thin ice and are close to committing a grave diplomatic error. Diplomacy? If the truth of the enlightened is obscured, then our relations are tainted and of no value. Answer my questions, or receive the punishment reserved for heretics. Do you believe? that the God of Light is the one and only God. Diplomacy may seem to you of little import, but I doubt that your governor will be of a similar opinion. Aggression towards an emissary of another nation is an error that could lead to war. You cannot hide from the divinity behind politics. But very well, I leave you in divine hands this time. I shall allow you to continue along your path. I am certain ours will cross again. And be aware that wheresoever you wander, you shall be weighed, measured, and judged. My pizza place doesn't have the new fries. I am, I am saddened. Also, we're gonna kill that man. Um, we're, we're gonna kill that man. Yeah. I, I, I will have to remember his name. Inquisitor Aloysius. You're going to die. Great. Okay. Good deal. Oh, is this another vendor? No, there's only one vendor, right? Yeah. I'm gonna say, my lord. Defender had like everything we needed. Uh, is that you? Can I talk to you anymore? No. Oh man. Hmm. Alright, where's our main quest here? There. Okay. Ooh. What did? Eggs. Why wait, go just sneak behind him and use his pelvic thrust. Boom, done. What's for lunch? Hey, that's a great call. We'll try that on the way out. Now, yeah, for those that don't know, uh, I have an ability that gives me um, extra defense 
and uh, all sorts of things. But to do it, I need to thrust my pelvis forward, and then God anoints my wang with a lightning bolt. You thought I was kidding. Oh, bless. Mm -hmm. okay. Now I'm jealous, Co. Hey, phew. trust me, I know the feeling. Oh, oh, you know, it's been a really long day at work, sweetie. I'm sorry. I'm just really not feeling it tonight. I'm just, I'm just tired and, you know, I drank too much and, oh, hold on a second. I'm ready! <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Alright, let's go. <laughs> I love some of the comments I saw in chat after that. Uh, okay. The Magpie Money Lender Shop. Oh, really? That's what that is. I don't want to do the main quest here quite yet. But we will soon. We will before we leave, for sure. Is that my shield buff? Or are my armpits just super stank right now? Is that my buff? Oh, there it goes. So wait, let me get this straight. I zap my wang to power up, then my armpit stank for the duration. This is the weirdest buff, dude. This is the weirdest buff. Um, I, uh, I, okay. Yeah, well said, well said. Something back there. Okay, is it, is it here? Yeah, here we go. <laughs> well, that's kind of morbid. Uh, hmm. What was that sound just then? Uh, it was a, it's a sound from a, a game called Danganronpa 2. <laughs> if you haven't heard of it, don't worry about it. Trust me, if you think that's trippy, you have not played Danganronpa. Harbor office. Oh! Oh, this is the area we jumped into. Right? I thought that was on... No, that was like over here, wasn't it? Hmm. Let's try to just walk it. Let's save it and just walk in and see what happens. This is just the port quarter, so this should be fine. Oh yeah, this is where we... Yeah, yeah, we were here earlier when we saw the ships. This place looks amazing. I love all the detail. Oh, salute! Salute! Ah, yes! Not much else at the end of this area, so let's kind of do a little lockpicking. Oh. I love that about this game. It drives me crazy when stuff, when you walk up like this and you try to run off the side and your character just like either stops or like runs in place because you're not on the same plane. But on this game, they just let you walk off. Thank you. It's a little thing, but it's a big deal. Mm. Okay. Okay. Back there. 
girl. May the enlightened bless you. Nah, he's a dick. He burned my tree pet. Oh god. Okay, there we go. <laughs> and this is my life now. Am I liking the game overall? Yes. Overall, I am really enjoying the game. Can't confirm. This is another thing that's kind of like I completely understand why it's this way, but I think still think it's kind of hilarious. Halt! These buildings are the property of Norts. No one is authorized to enter. Okay. So now, while maintaining eye contact. Good talk. How's your mother? Tell her I said hello. Now, to be fair, to be fair, that seems really silly, right? But then if you think about it, you would go, what's the alternative? Having to arbitrarily walk out of their sight line and then put it on and walk back? Honestly, I like it how it is. Because it's a game! To a Clark Kent, exactly. Is there a local phone booth nearby? We'll just we'll just jump in that for a second, no problem. QOL over realism. Yeah, Tarquinius one. Yeah, I think I think to a point, uh, absolutely. I would I would. Ooh. Ooh, man, we're finding great mage weapons. Nine is to level. But I would say to a point, absolutely. There there are points when sometimes the QOL can go a little overboard, and in some cases like break the immersion. But I'd say in most cases that you're right. Yeah. In most cases, you're right. Ooh, obsidian. Great. How much? We, we've got to have a decent amount of obsidian now. Wait. Can I go out here? Oh. Okay, we could drop off there. Ooh. Hmm. I'm guessing just similar to the other area, there'll probably be a quest or two or three, like in the last spot, that we'll have to come back here and do some stuff with. Mm. Here we go. Okay, so we've explored all of the harbor. We still need to explore the docks. Let's go do the docks before we think about it. Has Coke crafted anything significant yet? No. No, I first of all, I only have rank one crafting. So I need to I need to potentially get more crafting later. Um, but no, I really haven't crafted much at all yet. I have crafted a lot of potions. Um, I have been doing a lot of potion crafting and stuff, which has been great. This is a mage. I definitely need the mana potions. I think that's the first empty container we've had. Um, but yeah, outside of that, I haven't done, uh, I haven't done any, like, armor crafting or weapon crafting. Also, I'm, I'm kind of curious if I can make, um... Maybe I can make some magic-based armor somehow, or something that would help me as a mage. I'll have to poke around that a little bit more. Who are you? Your Excellency, Captain Vasco. What fair wind brings you here? Hey! To acknowledge Captain Vasco, that's cool. I must leave you. That's fun. So, I wonder how she knows him. Hmm. Just a small thing, but you can craft all rank threes for only materials, no skill needed at the first town. Just visit the blacksmith. Yep, we, we saw that. Thank you. Oh my God, Julia. Dude, Julia. So I think temporarily while we're playing Greedfall, um, 
<laughs> That's so good, Julia. That is so good. How do you work so quickly? Um, that's pretty amazing. That's pretty amazing. We'll have to get that in for our next uh, Greedfall stream. Thank you, Julia. That's perfect. That is perfect. Even, if I'm not mistaken, I think it even looks like the icon. But anyway, incredible. Incredible. Thank you, Julia. Light God says she has all this stuff prepared. Yeah, she, she's just made every emote she could possibly think I could want. And then whenever I just request it, she's like, boom, already done it. There you go. Good work. <laughs> Calamity Might says your talent makes me sick, Julia. <laughs> You're so good at what you do that it makes me sick to my stomach. Um. <laughs> Man, that's, that's some serious talent. My lord. All right, uh, let's see. We went in the coin guard barracks. Um, we explored back here. We went through the warehouses. We haven't been in the harbor office yet. We don't really have a reason to go there. I think we're going to go ahead and do this quest now. Oh, we have a residence here? Oh, what the hell? Do I have a house in every place? That's awesome. We got to go check that out. Uh, let's go do this. Let's go, let's go meet the person, see what's going on. Are we doing every city? Oh, how fun. How fun. Uh, you turn it. I need to U-turn it for a little bit. They call their town. Oh, that was Eden Town Square. Okay, I was gonna say they better not call this town Eden. Come on now. Come on now. After you're burning people in the town square. Terrible. Terrible. What's oh, that guy? Where's your god now? Oh! Okay, let's go. You are now mm. under the stern eye of the god of light. Hope that your underwear is clean. It seems like you do not hold the priests of Teleme in high regard. It's mostly that I do not trust them. They're hot-headed. You did a good job. Oh, he's talking about when we when we talked to Aloysius. Cool. Young man. Pardon me. Are you not part of the new governor's entourage? I'm his cousin. And I'm accompanying him on his mission to Tirfredi. What can I do for you, Father? Bishop Petrus. How divinely fortunate this is. Did you know that I had the honor of meeting you at your uncle's court when you were a child? I would never have imagined that you would grow up to resemble the island natives so closely. Um, the island was yet to be discovered. How could you have known? <laughs> you haven't lost your clever little tongue. You were always quite a remarkable young boy. I'm on my way to New Serene as an ambassador to the new governor. Do you think there would be room for me to accompany you? The roads are not truly safe. I must first meet the Mother Cardinal to present my respects on behalf of my cousin. I will accompany you, and then we can take the road together. I'm so happy our paths have crossed once again. Okay, so real quick, and I'm kind of serious about this. Uh, if there's any devs in chat, um, if you could let me know how I could pay him to read me bedtime stories, just shoot me a PM or something. That guy. Right there. Thanks. <clears throat> okay. Uh, let's... I think this is very similar to the first one. Oh. Nope. Oh, a little bit more restricted. Uh, oh, wait. He's coming with me as a third person? Nice. Oh, wow. This is nothing like the other governor's mansion. This is completely different. So much for copy pasta. Um... This room is is copied, I think. Now we found. Oh! Yeah. Ignore me. Wait, can I look at this guy's stats? Is he like part of my team? No, not yet. I'm I'm very curious what this guy can do. Kurt is our tank, but that guy looks like a tank. So I wonder 
Is he a better tank than Kurt? Kurt, maybe? Um, hmm. I'll have to see. Looking for destroyable walls, looking for loot, looking for orange items. In the last Governor's Mansion, we uh, really explored around and found like some keys and stuff off the beaten path. Maybe we can get lucky here, too. It's blocked. Oh. Oh. So however we get into here, that's the only way in. So we're going to have to... Hmm. Interesting. Okay. I really like that music. Okay. Just oh, ah! Oh, I thought we found like a new zone or something. That's too bad. Does it feel like your character has gotten stronger? Oh yeah, dude, absolutely. In fact, we went back through the main town after I hadn't been there for a little bit, and I just absolutely wiped the floor with the bandits in the main town. Like, my normal attack was hitting them for, like, like a sixth of their life. Where there's other enemies I can fight right now where my normal attack barely touches them. Like, we're talking pixels. So, yeah, yeah, there's definitely a feeling of, of getting stronger, for sure. Now, the big thing for me is in five or six levels, I get Storm. And Storm is an AoE Mez for 21 seconds. So this this is gonna be amazing. This is gonna, like it says right there, I ideal to turn the tide. Yeah, yeah, that's that's gonna like change my character. Hey Co, when are you starting Borderlands 3? Tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. EDT. We're most likely gonna play as Black, I think, but we'll see. Your Eminence, in the name of the Congregation Thanks, of Merchants, I present my best regards. May the light bless you and accompany you on these grounds with inspired guidance. I thank you. We truly wish that this visit will strengthen the ties between our two nations. I learned that you crossed paths with that of Inquisitor Aloysius. I beseech you to forgive his zealous nature. His faith is absolute. I'm gonna and kill I him. congratulate you to have appeased him. Your faith and your diplomatic skills honor you. Another subject brings me as well. The Malachor. The horrible blood plague decimating our peoples. A terrible matter that worries us all and reveals our imperfections and sinful nature. For he would never have allowed such an evil to spread without a deeper reason, a fault. Our theologians are certain that the Malachor is the work of a curse. And we have discovered that this island is home to a cult that venerates willfully a horrifying demon. What a fortuitous coincidence. A practical excuse for sending the Inquisition out to set the island ablaze. We must unearth this cult and tear it out by its sinister, sinful roots. We started to investigate a village not far from here, where strange happenings have been reported. I have begun investigations, and I confirm that a demon is certainly active in the area. Alas, the population is very secretive. <laughs> and we have great difficulty gleaning any useful information. But if the congregation would help us in this matter, in other words, if the Malachor troubles your cousin as much as myself, report to his majesty that the destruction of this pagan cult is the only way to eradicate the plague. And yeah, his no. help in obtaining BS. any information from the You know nothing about that. You have no welcomed. idea if it be would kill the plague. That your message will be transmitted, Mother Cardinal. Uh. God, I look forward to our next encounter. <sighs> Religion bothers me so much. Ah, uh, okay. Anyway. Um, so yeah, what I was thinking is I really want to hear this guy in his normal voice say assuming direct control. Um I, I, I just want... I, that's all I want him to say. Just assume what can I do for you, control. my child? Oh, my lord. Okay, let's let, listen to this guy's voice. What was your role at my uncle's court? Were you already an ambassador? No. But I was part of the embassy. I had only just started my career as a diplomat back then. Teleme was hoping to convert the congregation, and they had sent me to spread the word. 
I tried to teach you some of the basics because you had a predisposition for magic. But you were so young. You preferred to run around the halls with a wooden sword in hand chasing your cousin. Isn't this the vampire guy? Uh, I don't know, to be honest. That voice actor was also in Witcher 3? Oh, I believe it. That voice sounds familiar. I think we've I think we've heard it more than a few times. Oh, he was Aridin in The Witcher 3. Oh, cool. Cool. Awesome. I'll see you later, father. Take care, my child. Very cool. His name is Stephen Hartley. Ah, awesome. What a bro. What a bro. All right, can we go to any of those other... Oh, we can. And there's a question mark in one of them? Hold on. Yo, it's Gandalf. What's up, my dude? You shall not puff. May the enlightened always keep you in his divine blessing. Okay. Can I talk to you? Oh, just, Good just, day. Just, just like walked up behind him and just rudely pushed him. Make your damn bed. Got a marble fireplace and you can't make your bed and your room's a mess? Come on, man. Better than this. Uh, damn, dude, where are we going? Oh, this is the area that had the stairs and the other, or the ladder and the other governor's mansion. This was the, the back exit. But in this one, there's a grate instead of a stairway. Interesting. Uh, do we go everywhere here? No, we gotta go over here. Nice guest room. If I look to the right, and there are four cabinets pushing to the wall so you can't open the doors. I swear to God. All right, let's go. Is? Was that a steam error? No, okay. That was weird. I thought steam got me again. There we go. Oh, I got a friend request. Is that what it was? Oh, nice. I didn't even notice. Can we go in this room? Okay. Oh, he was in Sanua's Sacrifice 2 by buying pie? Oh, that's a good that, that one had great voice acting, my lord. Okay. So I think, was that the first? Yeah. So now we need to go talk to the Bridge Alliance, bro. But we also, what is this? This this is the main quest for these guys. Yeah. What is a mission? Oh, that's what we got off the bounty board. Oh, how cool. By the way, Big Badass Banana. Thank you so much, buddy. I really appreciate it. Thank you for the $10 tip. Um... to do that still. Where is, where is that? Oh, it's probably out the right side. Yeah, we got we got to go to the uh, the other town. So I guess it's there? Maybe that's it? Where is the other city? Dude. Wait. Oh my god. Okay. Bye-bye, Epic. Alright, cool. I'm talking. Um... So you can see the city clearly on the map here for San Mateus. Oh, maybe that's it. Is that it there? Maybe that's it. I don't see anything over here. That's like a ruins. Um, 
like a little tiny thing there. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe this is a tear, tear dob. Oh no, it's called Hikmet. That's right, it's called Hikmet. Where is that? Huh. I don't know. Hmm. The level of loot in that mansion was very disappointing. Well, yeah, that's, that's true. I, I can't, I can't deny that. Oh my God. Well, do a hard save. Guys, thank you so much for being here today. I wish I could play longer. I could play this all day for you easily. But unfortunately, I need to go and get ready for drop frames this afternoon. So what's gonna happen is I'm gonna jump off now and this channel will be live in about 30 minutes with drop frames. Uh, today we're gonna be talking about, well, Greedfall. We're gonna be talking about Twitch stuff. We got some news, some Borderlands 3 things. We've got all sorts of fun stuff coming and that's gonna be from one to four today. Then I'm off for the rest of today. Then tomorrow morning, we are starting Borderlands 3. As a quick note, because uh, I saw some people talking about this earlier. Um, I was originally going to play Moe's, but I woke up this morning and the top two Borderlands 3 streamers were not only both playing Moe's, but one of them was essentially playing the exact build that I was going to play. So we don't have three Borderlands streamers playing the exact same character. Um, I decided that I'm going to go ahead and play a different character. So that way, I know I know you guys are also fans of, of the other Borderlands streamers. So this way you can watch Moe's with some people. You can watch Flack here um, and we can do that kind of stuff. So as I said earlier, I'm totally happy playing Moe's or Flack. I, I'm super interested in both of them. So yeah, we'll, we'll figure out what we want to do. I think, I think we're going to do Flack. Um, I'm pretty sure we're going to do Flack. And I think I want to do that crit build that we were looking at because that crit build seems like it might be absolutely insane. Um, Grim Sage says another streamer is also playing Flack. Oh, F for the record, every class is being played, but I was more specifically talking about the streamers that are like, oh, we, we, our community has a lot of overlap with some of the other top streams. So specifically like uh, uh, King Athalian, uh, Baru, Professor Broman, like those those guys. I know Broman's playing um, Amara, uh, Baru and Gathalian are both playing Moe's. So I figured we'll play Flack and that way people can, you know, do that kind of stuff. So should be fun, should be fun. But anyway, dudes, I want to thank you all so much for being here. I really appreciate it. I hope so much that I see you guys here tomorrow morning at ADM EDT. We're going to be doing a full day of Borderlands 3, just going pretty much as, well, long as we can, doing as much as we can. So again, very much hope to see you guys there for it. As a quick reminder, um, tomorrow is going to be Borderlands 3 all day. Most likely Friday will be Borderlands 3 all day too. But then as we move into the weekend and next week, I'm going to bring back Greedfall in some capacity uh, as either a morning or afternoon game. Uh, we may even do some more all-day Greedfall streams, but just want to make it absolutely a thousand percent crystal clear. Just because we are going to be doing a couple full days of Borderlands 3 does not mean we are done with Greedfall. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, did I watch the System Shock trailer? No, I didn't. And I also didn't see the Final Fantasy trailer, but I will ping JP today and see if we can watch both trailers live during Drop Frames this afternoon. That should be pretty fun. Anyway, guys, I got to get out of here. Thank you so much for being here. Have an excellent morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are around the globe. Thank you so much for all the support today. It's been awesome. PC shut down with the three years. Won't play games and multi-highlight. Thank you for your subs. Also, the anonymous sub assassin was gifting subs. Yajirobi and Tiny Shopkeeper as well. Thank you so much for those. See you guys in just a little bit. Have a great rest of your day. And if I don't see you for drop frames, see you tomorrow morning for Borderlands 3.